Weather radios are incredibly valuable during severe weather, but if it's not programmed properly, it'll either drive you crazy or worse yet, it won't work at all. Here's some tips on programming these weather radios. Start by hitting the menu button. It's going to come up with set time, the time not necessary for proper operation on this weather radio. Uh, what you need to do is use the up and down arrows to navigate. And what you want to do is get to set location, then hit select. It's going to give you some options here. You can go single, any, or multiple. Uh, multiple is for multiple county codes. Any will go off for any county signaled by the transmitter. Single is what is used most often. Hit select. Then you're going to see same zero one. This is where we put in our county code. Hit select one more time. The county code for Sedgwick County is zero two zero one seven three. Simply use the up and down arrows to put that in. Once you have the code completely put in, hit select, then hit menu to get back to the main menu. Use the arrows once again to navigate to alert type. Hit select. You have a couple options here. You can go voice, display, or tone. We recommend voice. Continue navigating down. You'll see alert test. You hit select. That's what you'll hear during a severe weather warning. That will go off and then the voice of the National Weather Service will give you details on the warning. Hit menu one more time. Set channel is the last thing we need to do here. Press select. What you need to do is use the arrows to navigate until the signal comes in clear. If you hear static, it's not working properly. For Wichita and Sedgwick County, you want to be on channel 7. Your weather radio is now programmed. Make sure this button is in the on position. That means it's listening. For best reception, make sure you have the antenna up. And make sure your weather radio is always plugged in with fresh batteries. The batteries are just for backup. Once your weather radio goes off, turn on Cake News. You can watch our coverage live at cake.com. Also, follow us with the mobile app and on social media.